that works. So I'm at a slight disadvantage because I'm not in any of the budget negotiations uh, sitting on the finance committee. But one of the things that I did notice in the presentation was that if you looked at, at the revenues from 15 to 20, um, they were you know fairly consistent uh, growth pattern. And the last couple of years, you saw those going above that growth pattern. If you continue that line from 15 from 2015 to 2020 and continued that up through, um, the revenues that we're expecting are still on that trend line. So if we were, you know, are putting some aside from uh, uh, from the uh, surplus that we've had since we wrote the last uh, budget, since we wrote the supplemental, um, that's money that could be uh, either used or could be returned to taxpayers, uh, and we would still have revenues to spend. So it, it's a it's an issue of uh, you know a question of spending. Are we going to continue to uh, ratchet up spending, or are we going to stay on more of a consistent trajectory uh, and maybe give taxpayers a little bit of relief, um, especially if uh, the uh, personal income is not going to grow as fast? 